It's the rough part right here. Huh? It's the rough part right here, putting on that jersey. Yeah, Salute, salute. Now, you guys can see here, Caleb Mathis have officially revealed himself in that big number 13. A lot of you guys know he switched it over from that number 3 and he's rocking that 13 this year. And I must admit, it looked good on him. But I'm going to dig into not only that number 13 to be revealed, I'm going to dig into some content that he posted for you guys. Um, we're going to unpack a lot of things from Coach Mathis, his pops, etc. Um, you guys can see right here. You know, he said a lot of things in his caption as well, and we're going to unpack it all. But most important, if you guys are new to the channel, um, I'm going to ask y'all to subscribe right now. Everybody hit that like button. When you guys hit the like button, it truly helps out with the algorithm. So I'm going to give you guys a, you know, a little bit of opportunity to hit that like button if you haven't already. But most importantly, if you haven't turned on your post notification, please do so so you guys get all the latest content as soon as it becomes available. I want to make sure my audience gets it first. Now, Caleb, is you know, he he's here now. He's in at number 13. It looked good on him. He revealed it to his audience. As you guys can see here, he said, even if they grew on trees, they still wouldn't root for us. Paraphrasing. Uh, so that's a heck of a, you know, a caption right there for a young man. But basically, what he's saying is a lot of guys got the Colorado Buffs as the underdogs this year. A lot of guys want to hang their hat on that 1-11 season. As we all know, Coach Prime has revamped this roster, and he got a lot of dogs with him. Coach Mathis brought Caleb Mathis, etc. You know, a lot of these guys is here. They ready to go. They dogs. And uh, they looking forward to this year. Caleb is of the latest ones that post himself. As you're seeing, a lot of guys around the Colorado Buffs excited about their numbers. I showed you guys a lot of the behind-the-scenes uh, no footage. And now you guys can actually see these electrifying photos of these young men in their numbers. Now, Caleb is in at number 13. I'm going to give you guys a clip from his platform where you guys can see, you know, he, he you know, the build up about him getting that number 13, etc. It looked good on him. You know what I'm saying? A lot of guys rocked that 13 from Odell Beckham to a lot of the sweet guys in the NFL. And he's switching it up from that number three to 13. You know, at the end of the day, I, I like to see these young men when they finally get their jerseys. Everybody want to see their name on the back of that jersey. Everybody want to, you know, envision themselves doing great things. And Caleb is of the latest ones to post himself in the photo uh, or, or post a photo of him in that number 13 with that big mat that's on the back of it. Y'all know what it means to him and his, you know, his pops, etc. Uh, I'm going to give you guys this content right here that's owned by him. Again, if you guys is new to the channel, please subscribe right now. Everybody hit that like button. It helps out with the algorithm. You know, you guys do that. I truly appreciate it. But most important, like I said, turn on your post notification. I'm going to give you guys the content that's owned by him. This is the way he looked when he finally put that 13 on for the first time. And you guys can see how electrifying this 13 look on him with the photo that he provided along with the caption. Let's get into this, you know, this footage right here. And we're going to come back on many other things from Coach Mathis and the way I feel about this young man and the things that he would do. First, let's get into this clip. Like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notification. We're going to jump right into it. Let's go. It's the rough part right here. Huh? It's the rough part right here, putting on that jersey. Yeah, feels good to be back in this thing. Well, we had on the white things, but... Fuck. Yeah, feel good. Rate the drip one to ten. Yeah, yeah. You know, some simple. I'll, I'll give it a solid eight, you know, some simple. You're not doing nothing too extravagant. I gotta give me some... No, he, 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 he look clean, you know. He look clean cut. <laughs> Now, there you guys have that right there. You guys can see Caleb Mathis. 
I'm excited about that 13. I try to give you guys the entire feel of him now that he revealed himself in that number 13. And it's good to see. The spinoff of that, you guys know this is Coach Mathis' son. Um, Coach Prime, Coach Mathis, um, they've been at it for a very long time. Now, to spin it back to Caleb, this young man had been attached to Coach Prime, his father, etc. Way back down to truth days um, when they was just little youngsters. You guys heard Coach Prime talk about how him and Coach Mathis have been at it for a long time, but you guys got to think about it a little bit deeper. Not only him and Coach Mathis, you got the players like Caleb that's been at it with these guys as well. And it's amazing. This is really an amazing story. One day they're going to have to make a movie about Coach Prime and these coaches that he have here um, that's been with him since these guys was at Truth and came all the way up um, through the ranks playing football in Texas, so on and so forth. And to now these guys went, you know, to Jackson State. Of course, Caleb wasn't there, but come over to Colorado. And, you know, these guys is continuing to grow in that direction. And now they're at the college level, and who knows how far they'll take it. If someday they win a national title or something great like that, you know, this is just a movie that's being played out right in front of our eyes to see how far these coaches been with these young men. Um, Caleb Mathis been with his father, which been with Coach Prime. And Coach Prime have seen these players blossom into great young men, you know, future NFL players, etc. All of this is, you know, turning out to be a storybook NFL, uh, the national title, you no know, fathers, you no know, um, Coach Prime the father, his son, Coach Matthew the father, his son. You know, there's all this together when you put it all in a, in a bundle together. This is a perfect movie script, if you ask me, to see how far these men have came with these young men and how far they've came with each other. The loyalty is everything. The brotherhood is everything. And these young men is following the game plan and is working for everyone from financially to, you know, the ability to be able to compete at the highest level, etc. I'm going to give you guys a clip here to show you guys how much Caleb Mathis loved his father. You know, he gave him a gift on Father's Day. You guys can see the excitement in his father's eyes, etc. Now, you guys, again, this content is owned by Caleb. You guys subscribe if you're new to the channel. Everybody hit that like button. I'm going to give you guys a little clip before I close out on what I think about everything. Thank you so much. Yeah, next up is your... I'm not even going to say it. It's Caleb. <laughs> He said only sign I'm I think I you, don't you already know what it is? Yeah, but I want to see what it says. Right. Okay, it's not scripted, right? Yeah. Does it actually smell good or are you lying? No, it smells wonderful. <laughs> it smells great. Here, it smells okay. I smell some other day. Yeah, don't you think he would have smelled it before you bought it? Yes. Well, there you guys have it, man. This right here again has been a perfect display of great fatherhood, hard work, dedication from everybody involved, to be honest. I want to bring my audience the fullness of the content. Um, and hopefully you guys can appreciate it all at the end of the day. Like I said, Coach Mathis and Coach Prime been at it for a very long time. But more importantly than anything, like I always say, I'm sure the biggest accomplishment for these men, you know, these ex-NFL players, etc., the biggest accomplishment, you know, from those guys to see how their sons look at them, how their family look at them, how the people in the community look at them, and now how the college football scene at the biggest level will look at them. Because who knows, Coach Mathis may get him a head coaching job within the next three years or so. You never know how this, you know, this this football realm plays out when teams start winning, coaches start getting new opportunities. Who knows if people ever leave Coach Prime or where they stay locked in arms no matter what and go to the top together and stay together. But at the end of the day, everyone had family, different opportunities will present itself. Um, these these men some would eventually go off in the NFL, God willing. And at the end of the day, it's good to see these guys have a great spiritual belief, great fathers, great leaders, great men. And at the end of the day, you can see the reflection in that from their sons as these young men is going out trying to accomplish great things. You guys can see here the caption that Caleb left on his um, Instagram here when he posted himself in that big 13 as he's excited about if it. If them haters grew on trees, they still wouldn't root for us. And you guys can see he coming into this season with a chip on his shoulder. As many of these Colorado Buffs, and one thing I'm getting about these Colorado Buffs, they all have a chip on their shoulder. They all have something to prove. Coach Prime put a team together of dogs, a great coaching staff with something to prove as well. And Colorado going to have a great year in my opinion. Like, comment, subscribe right now. 
everybody turn on your post notification don't forget to hit that like button i'm gonna read what everybody got to say in the comment section below hopefully you guys you know and enjoy this full content right here as i try to unpack everything about these players and i will read everything you guys got to say in the comment section below thank you so much subscribe right now like comment i'm gonna read it thank you so much catch you on the next one